Four, the city of Clearwater is without a mayor. Former Mayor Frank Hibbard resigned during a city budget meeting. His sudden departure left city council members in shock. Hibbard was three years into his four-year term. News Channel 8's Brittany Muller joins us live in Clearwater. After speaking with several council members, they were blindsided this morning, Brittany. They really were, Stacey and Josh, and this is the center of the controversy, the budget to develop this vacant land into a new city hall, and it comes with a $90 million price tag, one that Frank Hibbard didn't agree with. Former Mayor Frank Hibbard says it's one of the toughest things he's done. I'm not the right leader for this council anymore, and I'm, I'm concerned where the city is going. Right before Hibbard packed his briefcase and walked out of a city budget meeting on Monday morning, council was discussing the development of a new city hall and public works building with a $90 million price tag. Because this is simple math and we're not doing very well on the test. But I can tell that really I am not the right person. Hibbard disagreed since there would be a $60 million deficit. It was actually a four to one. He was the one, I think, on the city hall that he didn't want to build a new city hall. He wanted to have it here in the library uh, when we talked about it uh, within, I think we've been talking about it about a year and a half. That didn't go well. And we Council member David Albrighton says he was in shock, adding this is a loss for the city. And while they didn't always agree, Albrighton says that's why there's five council members. And we're in a, you know, stuck in a, uh, you know, downtown in an office building. And, you know, we've been there five years. It's time. It's time for Clearwater to have a new city hall. Council member Kathleen Beckman echoed Albrighton's call for a new city hall. The work of the city will continue. We're in a great spot. You know, we have a lot of wonderful things going on, and I'm excited to be part of it. Council says they will next discuss those next steps with the city attorney. Now, this resignation comes as the city officially seated a new city manager earlier this month. Reporting live this afternoon in Clearwater, Brittany Muller, 8 on your side.